Rosie Baddy in the club. The I Spice and Madeline, they're all playing chess against all of you lot, bro. The people that are falling for. Did he cheat on me? I have no idea. He blindsided me and he betrayed me. Madeline Archie has confronted Central Sea Live about the ice jibber infidelity incident, indicating that she is not done venting her frustrations on him. As a result, things have become sticky for Central Sea, has begun to acknowledge his error and ask Madeline for jibber, but she quickly corrected him and placed him in his proper place. So be sure to watch the entire movie. For complete information about the romantic triangle between American rapper Ice Spice, British rapper Central C, and model influencer and former partner of musician Jibber RJ, go here, has led to an abundance of memes, debates, and theories on social media sites including Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and TikJabber. The hashtags three stars have dominated trends. They are always followed attentively by their fans, but let's go back to the beginning, a lot of people on social media like the Jibber. Since they initially started dating, Dating, Central C and Madeline RJ's relationship has received a lot of attention because to their frequent posts on Instagram and Tick Jabber that showcase their shared jibber and give credit to her unique artistic and creative work the rapper's life began to revolve on Madeline and the two of them formed one of the most well-liked pairs at the time, and her Instagram story Jabber the Debate in London. From a jibber interior interestingly, the rapper also posted a video of himself in London driving the same car. Thoughts about a possible love relationship between the two performers emerged at the same time as they were later jibber together at many events. Also gained popularity soon after Ice Jibber revealed that she had worked with Central C on the song initially, sparking speculation of a possible musical partnership. It centers on a jibber man on his girlfriend rather than keep quiet, Ice Spice and the rapper's chemistry was instantly obvious to Central C and Madeline's fan base. Madeline made the decision to address the rumors on social media by expressing her astonishment and discontent with the situation in a number of jibber that suggested she felt mislead by Central C. The Ice Spice and Madeline, they're all playing chess against all of you lot, bro. The people that are falling for the whole, oh, wait, the situation that's going on. It's all marketing. You, if, if, if you like can think and you can like you, if you're not dumb you can see bro like them reposting like things that like seem like it relates to it like the reposting thing is just so bait they're literally growing like people like that never happens when real life situations like oh yeah a celebrity gets up they never do too much these are doing way too much it's all a marketing thing and some of you like actually believe it you like actually stupid bro and it's literally working because a lot of you lot are falling for it. Bro, you know how much they're generating just off this whole, like, scheme? Because people are just going onto the tune, hearing the lyrics, seeing this, going onto the video on YouTube just to see what Ice Spice was doing, the Central Sea, all of that shit. And it's just circulating more income for them, bro. I guess that's why Central Sea is that big, bro. Because it's marketing is a different level. Big man thing. Ice Jibber has been posting pictures of herself with Central C on Instagram. In one, he is putting his arm around her shoulder, and in another, their watches are visible. In many of the angry comments that followed, such as just Jabber you literally knew he had a girl y'all should have known she was never a girl's girl, upset people. You literally homewrecked a relationship, one fan said. After thereafter, Madeline Jabber a podcast in which she discussed the Central C and the Ice Spy issue in more detail. At this point, it's clear that the Central Sea is not a publicity gimmick, and that Madeline was actually harmed by it. Did he cheat on me? I have no idea. He blindsided me and he betrayed me, that is what I do know. And as far as I am aware, they were a PR stunt. The issue is, was I was his girlfriend. So what the fuck are you doing not telling me? And actually, what are you doing doing that in the first place? But also, what are you doing not telling me? The whole thing was fucking weird. I had no idea it was happening. And I, they did not run it past me. They did not get my consent. They didn't run it past my team. Anyway, what that guy did was fucking crazy, okay? And let's just not forget that he was the one who owed me honesty, transparency, truth, uh, respect, communication and that regardless of other factors the bottom line is no one else owed me that okay and and it doesn't mean that other things aren't true or that people can't have their opinions about other things but he is the only person that i can or will hold accountable for any of this please get it in your fucking heads this was never a pr stunt on my side it was a pr stunt on theirs that's where it gets confusing the item is crucial not that it's the most surprising thing to happen c has made it obvious in several interviews that he is an infidelity and jibber single man 
However, it also jabber the impression that Madeline lacks dignity because she allowed it to occur, therefore it's quite bad that he didn't even inform her in advance. Madeline was getting a ton of support on this podcast from commenters saying things like, he doesn't deserve her, he treated her jibber than a cheater, but truly, I really need you to respect yourself, stick to your guns, jibber someone else, or simply go back to ladies and never go back to him. The present female internet renaissance. Jibber up when women feel mistreated by males is such a lovely thing, Madeline. I am this close to calling the fucking police because that is a threat. He has had no direct access to me ever since that book. I'm thinking that this conversation is going to be our love, our relationship, so tell me why 10 hours later he's posted up in the fucking past. Guys, imagine you break up with your boyfriend one night and the next day he is posted up with Ice Spice and Chrome Heart. I didn't even actually get to break up with him and he's already with the next girl. He gave me not even like 12 hours notice before he was being filmed in Chrome Hearts with her. The flight from America is 12 hours. She was already on the fucking plane. Hey, woman to woman, what did he get you from Chrome Hearts? Because all I ever got was a dang dog. So yet again, I am in the comment section with you guys. Such is a bot. This is four days until my birthday. When I saw him in her comment section like that, I tweet so fucking bad, I was gonna put this screenshot on my story. I thought rapper boyfriend was at least considerate enough to let me have my birthday week, and then I see them at the club on the 6th of July, my birthday's on the 7th. You guys remember when he made me pay for my own birthday ticket into the zoo? At least I woke up to something better this year. That is why my friends had to turn up to my house in gorilla suits the day of my birthday, because I had just woken up to a video of him with a big booty baddie in the club. You are doing so much good. This signifies that women should stand up for more than just themselves. After they've been sexually assaulted by males, but also to examine the men in their present jabber more closely or consider what to avoid doing in the future. The way you intellectualize the suffering. Before we continue watching the jibber, Team Madeline's chauvinista fans are leaving comments on the pain women endure when they aren't treated fairly, which may also help some men see things differently. What are your honest opinions about the whole jibber, guys? Will Madeline finally reconcile with Central C, or will he settle down and create a family? Please leave a remark below. This brings an end to today's video. Please subscribe for more celebrity videos and enable the post notification bell so that you don't miss any upcoming uploads. I'll see you in the next one. Rather than going radio silence on it, it was a good jibber for her.